nor compile them with God and his messenger have forbidden it, nor embrace the religion of truth from among those who are given scripture until they pay tax, willingly, humbly, fully humble. Okay, so the part where it says, um, have, all right, fight for those who do not believe in the, in the last day, nor compile them with God and his messenger have forbidden, nor embrace the religion of truth from among those who were given scripture. Okay, we respond with, um, this This was some of the specific releva uh, revelation, re revelation that was sent down um, regarding particular situations. This was at the time of uh, pagans of Arabia, where they were uh, violently disoriented uh, the treaties that of Prophet um, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi and uh, Muhammad, uh, Muslims had to fight for their survival for the new, new, newly established state in Medina. Okay, and then um, uh, for the taxation systems. Okay, so these taxation systems are very normal. Every every country has their own taxation system. If you read Ezra 420, we have a taxation system. Says, uh, Caesar was supposed to pay tax in Luke 2025. 20, um, Islamic rule always um, says um, um, Muslims have to pay non, non uh, pay jizya or tax. But this is for protection, okay? Uh, there were many obligations. Women, children, the, uh, the elderly, the clergy, the poor, and those who were not able to work were exempt. Uh, those who opted to join the army were also exempt. Um, uh, people that were poor, that couldn't pay, this, um, pay the jizya, they weren't forced to. Uh, Muslim rulers um, refunded the jizya if they failed to protect them and your reign. Oh yeah, my time is done. Okay. So guys, if you notice, this guy is a kid. He's uh, basically reading uh, from somewhere. He doesn't uh, uh, have any debate skills. So I'm debating a kid. It's okay. Guy, my friend, I specifically asked you to start with 928. Let us start with 928. Oh, you have believed. Indeed, the polytheists are unclean, so let them not approach the Masjid al-Haram after this. So Muhammad gets this so-called divine revelation. He says, don't let anyone, including the Jews and the Christians and the pagans, enter Mecca, especially not come near Masjid al-Haram, which is the mosque of Mecca, right? So that means the trading, because you need to understand that the people in Mecca, the Muslims, they were trading with Romans, they were trading with Christians and Jews, they were trading with all different kind of people, uh, so with non-Muslims. So the people started to complain, they started to cry, like all the Muslims, they always love to cry. So they started to cry to Muhammad, they said, hey, the trade stops, that means we are getting poor, we, uh, we, are, we feel poverty, right? So Muhammad, conveniently always Allah hastens to fulfill his desires like Aisha said the solution comes with 929 this is the context guys and I can show you Ibn Kathir later too then Muhammad says you don't need to work anymore let the Jews and the Christians work and the solution is jizya mafia protection money Fight those who do not believe in Allah or in the last day and do not consider unlawful what Allah and his messenger have made unlawful and who do not adapt the religion of truth, which is Islam. From those who were given the scripture, who are these? Who are those? The Jews and the Christians. The pagans will die anyway if they don't accept Islam. But if the Jews and the Christians don't uh, want to accept Islam, it's okay. But we will force jizya on them, which is mafia protection money, until they give the jizya willingly while they are subdued, humiliated. This is a false scumbag translation by Sahih International because the Arabic says, Wahun saghirun. Wahun saghirun. Okay, let me give you also the, the Ibn Kathir context so you can read it for yourself. Okay? Wait, wait. I, I, I understand. Okay. I understand, but let me give you the, the context of Ibn Kathir so you don't say Rob Christian is lying because Ibn Kathir knows the Quran better than you and me. Read read what, what, it, what Ibn Kathir says. If you are really a man, this is Ibn Kathir that I posted in the room. Open it up and read it. Since you know more than Ibn Kathir, if you say okay. I know better than Ibn Kathir, then uh, it's okay. But if you... Time's up. Okay, let me go. Okay, okay read Ibn if Kathir. About, read Ibn Kathir. Okay, fine. Okay, let, let me go. Okay, you say you want to talk about context. Okay, let's talk about context. Now, let's go verse 25. Indeed, God has given you believers victory on the battlefields, even at the battle of Hunain, when you took pride in the, your great numbers, but they proved no advantage to you. The earth, despite its vastness, seemed so close to you, then turned their back and retreat. Okay, second point. You talk about the uh, uh, verse 28. Do you know what the verse 28 is talking about? He's talking about idol, uh, idols, idol worshipping. That was um, by the pagans. Okay? 
And then if you if you want the uh the fear for this, all believers indeed the polytheists are spiritually impure. So this re this is referring to uh Go to Ibn Kathir, I post in the room. Because of it's my time, please. Okay, Ibn Kathir, Ibn Kathir. Impure, please, let me talk. If the spiritually uh, spiritually impure because of um idol I, I, uh, idolatry or worshiping of idols. Um and then we read the second part. So they should not approach you, the sacred mosque, after this year. Okay, so this is first off. Do you know about the uh, migration of Mecca to Medina, right? This is this is after the mi migration of Mecca to Medina, and then if and then for example, the rest is rest. Okay, now your time. Go. Okay. So guys, are you gonna read, sorry, no, 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 wait, 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 wait. One uh, second, one second. Um, uh, Mr. Fick, are you gonna read Ibn Kafir on the on the on the? No, he's the, he's too scared. He's too okay, scared. Fine. If, if you give me time are right now, read I'll read this right now. I'll read this right now. So is it, okay, you read it, but it's, Rob's time starts after you finished. Yeah. Can you give me the link to this website? Quranx.com. This no, is from Quranx.com. Exactly. I don't want to have to look for it. Just give me the link. Uh, guys, we need to help him with Quranx.com. This is this is the link. <laughs> this is your official website. I, I'm more go than to Tafsir. Go to Tafsir Ibn Kathir. I I That's, already put it in the room for you, man. I already put it. Open up that. Yeah. What's Quranx. the exact link? What's the exact link? Oh, Lord of mercy. Brother, if you want, if you have evidence. Give me the exact source. Please. That is the exact force source. If I type in Quranics.com, <laughs> look, 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 look. What I made it easy for you, man. I type in Quranics. Yeah, in and, and then go, and go, go to okay, go to commentaries, then go to Ibn Kathir, and then go to nine twenty eight, nine twenty nine. Okay, so Ibn who? Ibn Ibn Muhammad, uh, Ibn uh, Hafza. No, Ibn Kathir. Lord of He's mercy. He's not listed. He's Lord actually not listed. Are you, are you even focusing, my friend? Focus. Yes. Focus. Abdul. Here's the same one if he, he wants this one. Yeah, this is the one. Yeah. Click on Ibn Kathir and then choose 928. This is not from the website that you showed me. This is from... This is the same Wait, website. Wait, Sargon? No, Sargon, what he said is not from the site site. Yeah. Uh, Wait, which site are you referring to? The one that Sargon posted? No, no. That is not the same. Go, 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 so go to Ibn right. Kathir. To Ibn Kathir. Click on Ibn Kathir. Okay, one second. No, that's not the right one, Miss Piggy. We are talking about 92928. Okay, I'm here. Verse what? 928929. We're still talking about the context of those two verses. Go ahead. Okay, I'm gonna snip you them. Hold up. I'll post for you, man, since you're too lazy. Yeah. Here, there's a website from yeah. Quranx. Open that up. Open Was that up. Is that too hard for you? Okay, I, I found you, it right here. It, it gives you the context. I'm, looking looking for it than me to post I'm more than glad to read this for you. This is from the Quranx he said. No, no, I you don't, don't, I, don't I, copy, don't copy, don't copy a small part. Copy everything. I did, that's what I did for you. Okay, fine. I'll Abdul. copy everything. Uh, this is from, it's, this is 28 and 29. 28 is the first part. Yeah. Can you, can you just click on what I uh, sent you here? This is the same website, man. I made a screenshot. It's not the same website. Yes, it's, it it's, is. It's, it's, it is. The Quranx well, has, so where's the, from the same website okay, fine. Wait, 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 wait. First off, it has a title, Real Context for Jizya and, and the context for of a, a Muslims who lie about it. This is a, a this is clearly yeah. Islamic hate. You this are is, this is my, hate this is my own screenshot he and I put something, yeah. I put that above text, that's my own shit, okay? But oh, I'm okay. talking about what's under that. It is the same stuff. I only put red lines for you because you Muslims sometimes have issues with focusing. Read everything there just click on it and read okay if you take anything out I'll give you some i time. didn't take anything yeah. out okay you know what, why don't you read the entire tafsir if you please that? let me yeah i will gladly read it please just just give me some time then i'll, I'll be back oh man it says this guy is is such a, a kid it, let me let me read it let me again let me repeat myself and if you fear poverty Allah will enrich you out of his bounty. The bounty for what? When you attack people and you get a uh, bounty from it. Muhammad bin Ishaq commented, the people said, the Muslims said, 
our markets will be closed. Why? Because the unclean Romans, unclean pagans, unclean Jews, unclean Christians are not allowed to come near the Masjid al-Haram, which is in Mecca. Our markets will be closed. Our commerce disrupted, and we will, and we earned will vanish. So basically, they are afraid that they will get poor because the trading stops. So Allah revealed this verse, and if you fear poverty, Allah will enrich you out of His bounty. Then continue. The ayah means till this will be your compensation for the closed market that you feared would result. Therefore, Allah compensated them for the losses they incurred because they severed ties with idolaters. So they they traded with idolaters, with pagans, right? So by the jizya, now that's this is the solution. Nine twenty nine. According to Ibn Kathir, by the jizya they earned from the people of the book. Who? From the Jews and the Christians. Ibn Abbas says, Mujahid, Ikrama, Sa'id ibn Jubair, Qatada, and Ad Dahraq and others, Allah said, This is why Allah compensated for the losses by the amount of jizya they took from the people of the Dimma. Who's, who are the Dimmis? The Jews and the Christians. The order to fight people of the scripture until they give the jizya. So Muslims are nothing but mafia thugs putting jizya protection money, mafia protection money, so they don't, don't need to work anymore. Their only work is fighting, fighting, conquering all the lands. And the solution to get money is jizya, the bounty from the Jews and the Christians. Thank you very much. This is the context, guys, of 928, 929. And this guy's still asking Prophet Google, peace be upon him. He's a kid, guys. He's a kid. Please bring me a sheikh. You know what this kid said? This kid. It took him twenty minutes to answer the question whether yeah. or not. Yeah, he was. He was reading. He was reading from a, a new daddy school or a school That's daddy, basically. Yeah. Call him, you know, he was quoting Soheb Webb. You've heard of him, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, what, what? What did he mention? Mustafa guy or something? Who was Mustafa? Who's Mustafa, I've never man? Heard of this guy. Yeah. We're talking well, about the Ibn Kathir. It took 20 minutes for him to uh, admit that Christians are not monotheists. Yeah. Man. Asked, okay, so what should be done? And you already said, he said, we should pay jizya. Uh, we should go and pay Muslims jizya. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and as you yeah, guys, as we conclude, yeah. So the context, 928, 929 is, Muhammad forbid pagans, Jews, Christians, the Romans, everyone who traded with Muslims, they were not allowed to enter Mecca anymore. That means no more trades, money is gone. Uh, imagine if you are a merchant, and you are trading with idolaters, with pagans. That means it stops and that means no money comes uh, to Mecca anymore. No money enters Mecca anymore. So the Muslims are scared. They are fearing for dying because there is no money, there is no food anymore. So Muhammad says, you, you don't need to fight anymore. Uh, sorry, you don't need to work anymore. Just force okay, jizya. No, no. Let me finish. Uh, okay. Just put jizya on people. Put mafia protection money on the on the non-Muslims. There is no need more uh, to work for you anymore. And that means you have to fight alone. That's your only work. Put jizya on people, and that's how the way you got money. So the bounty. That's the jizya. That's the way Muslims can get money. No need for them to work. The only work is fight, 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 conquer lands, and let the Jews and the Christians work for you. Okay, okay Mr. Uh, Fick, Mr. Fick, before you respond, are you going to respond according to what's been put to you? Yep, I'll respond. You're going to respond according to the Tasfir? Yes, uh, I'm going to respond on the verses that you quoted, 20 and 29. Okay. Yeah, Ibn Kathan, based minutes, on buddy. his website, based on the Quran. Okay, ready? Okay, you got two minutes, buddy. Uh... Okay. Uh, okay. So he said this I means will comp this comp this will be your compensation for the closed markets that you feared. Okay. If you read right after, uh, and 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 when he talks about the verse, and then right after it says it says the same things that I just said. And those who acknowledge not who those who acknowledge not the religion of truth among the people of the scripture, this honorable ayah was revealed within the fight within. Uh, with the order to fight the people of the book. After the pagans were defeated, the people entered Allah's religion in large numbers, and the Arabian Peninsula was secured under the Muslims' control. Allah commanded his messenger to fight the people of the scripture, Jews and Christians, on the ninth year of Hijra, and he prepared his army to fight the Romans, and he and called the people to uh, jihad, an, uh, announcing his intention and destination. The messenger sent his intent to, to various um, er er 
Arab areas around Al Medina to gather forces, and he collected an army of thirty thousand. Some people from Al Medina, some hypocrites, and in, in, in and around Al lagged behind. For that year was a year of dry intensity. The Messenger of Allah marched, heading towards uh, Ash, um, Asham to fight the Romans until he reached uh, Tabak, where he sat camp for about twenty days. Next days, next to his uh, water resources. He then where, you, where are you from. reading? Where are you reading from? This is from your uh, source, by the way. Um, Ibn Kathir? Okay, is this Ibn Kathir? Yeah, Ibn okay. Kathir. Okay. Uh, control so, what are, you, what are you trying to say? What are you trying to say? Okay, no, no. This, okay, fine. Let me continue my argument, okay? Okay, so... Mr. Fick, Mr. Fick, Mr. Fick, Mr. Fick, Mr. Fick, one second. I know, and we, we appreciate the fact that you're reading something. But what we want from you is to be able to summarize what it is that you're trying to say, as opposed <laughs> to just reading something verbatim. Yeah. Because you reading something, right, doesn't necessarily deal with yeah. the situation. Summarize your argument. Yeah, summarize he, your point. He, be condensed. Be concise. And be <laughs> to the point. He's that's, like that's what we're trying to say. You, he sounds. You oh, signed, my I, friend. Listen. Please, you're sounding like a broken time. record. You, yeah. You, you're sounding like a broken time. record. Everyone can read. But but refute me. Refute my statement. Refute. Sure, I will. Okay. 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 So, okay. Can, can you do that, Mr. Fick? Yeah. Sure. Okay. So on the last sentence of his uh, thing, um uh, he said the order to fight people of the scripture until they give jizya. But this was your claim, right? Fight, fight the people till they give jizya. Okay, read right under. Fight then, everyone. Right under where I just read. Where the where the text I just read. Tell me, what do you find? Well, like I said, ba basically, I, I need to re I like I need to repeat myself because you Muslims cannot focus. I'm telling you, you, context, you take this out Abdul. Context. Listen, you ask me, let me answer you. Focus. Don't call me Abdul. Don't you call me are Abdul. the Abdul yeah, of the son scared. of Abdul. You are Abdul, son of Abdul. Abdul. Are you are you scared to be called Abdul? What's wrong with you, man? You are an Abdul. You are a slave of Allah. So are you ashamed? No. Okay. Don't call me. Don't call me something. I, you I are I you are Abdul ibn Abdul. Okay. Let let us go back to the context. No. First again. Time, no. Again. No. 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 You are Abdul. Abdul. You no, are Abdul. Abdul. You are Abdul. What were you, what are you going to do about it? Dude, you are. You really are you an Abdul? Arrogant. Are you an Abdul or not? Are you an Abdul or not? You realize how arrogant you sound. If you no. have any respect. No. Him. If so I'm a Christian, respect. I'm a Christian. I'm a Christian. You are an Abdul. You are an Abdul. Respect. Deal with it. This kid wants Dude. to talk about respect. Yeah. And when, when he thinks that he's just. Dude, I'm just saying. Look, look how the way I've been talking, and look how the way you're talking. Okay. Yeah. First off, Abdul. Okay. 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 Relax. Relax. We get it. 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 Now. I don't know whose time it is, but uh, this conversation is kind of like, I mean... He's a kid, thing. man. He's a kid. You, 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 it, it's kind of coming across that you... And I just mean really objective with you. It, it sounds like you, every argument that's put to you regarding... And they, these guys are bringing to you sources from your tasfirs, from your hadith, from yeah, the Quran. Yeah, bring them it, sources. Too. One second. And what they're wanting you to do is not for you to arbitrarily just read something out and then say that's addressed the point. No, they want you to actually put your own mind and summarize what you think. That 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 that's that's very simple for you to be able to do. Okay, fine. Like just to summarize, Let me summarize. To be able to, right? Please don't read something off and start reading okay, yeah, off sure. stuff. Yeah. Okay. okay. But, but then they say, um, we want the exact thing, exact thing. They say, then they go into the context of Arabic. Look at this Arabic, Arabic. See, what am I supposed to do? You guys you guys want the littlest of things, but then now you guys want, now if I read you the littlest of things, now you guys want the summary. Okay. Now, okay. So um, let me say this. So so uh, the people of, um, so people entered um, this Arabia in large numbers. And then uh, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was forced to, so far, do all these things to uh, command jizya and so forth. That's that's how the origin of jizya started. What? No. If you read, no. no. I'll post the thing Ibn right Kathir now. was clear. Muslims were trading with pagans. They were trading with Jews and Christians. They were trading with the Romans. The Romans were Christians. So Muhammad forbids anyone who is not a Muslim to enter Mecca anymore. So you are not allowed to enter Mecca to do trading with muslims so muslims are afraid they are crying so stop, let me wait 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 they are crying no no it's not my time you had your chance so muslims are crying muhammad muhammad what did you do no our trading is stopped no more money from us we are afraid we will get poor so muhammad says wait a second i just got an ayah from allah 929 
The solution for your problems, that you are fearing that you are getting poor, and Ibn Kathir, I quoted it many times, I even put it on for you on, on a silver platter. You could read it. Everyone had read it. Everyone in the room read it with me. It's clear. The solution is jizya, mafia protection money. Jews and Christians need to work hard. You have to put jizya on them. They will give you the money. Yeah, you are forcing them to take the jizya from them right that's the way you can get money from them so you can fight with me the only work for muslim is fighting conquering lands that's your only job let the jews and the christians pay the jizya for you so you will not get poor you don't need to fear uh, for your children and and wives that they will die from hunger so get the money from the jews and the christians force pagans to become Muslims or as Aslim Teslim that means convert or else pagans do are not like the Jews and the Christians they need to convert they to Islam you don't understand that where does it say treaty I just yeah. I just from, quoted okay. for you from because my, here my hand held Quran right your head and who's Mustafa Qadr who's Mustafa Qadr we are we are talking about Ibn Kathir Tafsir what, are, what yeah. is wrong with you focus 928 929 that's that's the context of nine you need Maybe to you, you no no you need to you need to start with 928 then read to 929 that's the context the context start not with 929 it could starts with the ayah before this is why i told you go to ibn kathir tafsir 928 929 even if you go to ibn kathir uh, he starts with 28 because you can't just read 929 without context you muslims i told you you muslims always scream for context we go to the context i provide for you ibn kathir who is one maybe today muslims even consider him to be the number one guy on tafsir right so this is why i went to ibn kathir i didn't went to mustafa or a scumbag who who, who just wrote a, yesterday a book for you no 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 we are going to mr. ibn kathir mr fick do you understand rob's questions i don't think so okay so you're saying that just because they're different tafsir that means that they have different interpretations. What tafsir? Show me his tafsir. No. Put it in a okay. text. Put okay. it in a text. I will. I will find you his tafsir right now. Um, Mustafa Qadir. Okay. Okay. Go. 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 Go to poop, uh, Google. Peace be upon him. Prophet Google. I give you five minutes. Come back and post it in a text. Okay. Ask Prophet Google. Peace be upon him to help you. It's okay. <laughs>